Video editing software market has currently settled into what appears to be a four-tiered arrangement based on cost, features and ease of use. In making a decision on which is the best video editing software for you, it helps to have an understanding of these four levels. This can help you match your needs to a program designed to meet those needs, not to mention keeping any reviews you read in perspective. All too often, a video editor may receive good or bad reviews based on the reviewer's personal preferences or his idea of some generic home video enthusiast. It's not that the reviewers are trying to be deceptive or overly opinionated. It's just that at the moment the range of software available is quite big and the range of different uses by the consumer is even bigger. Originally, digital video editing software fell into two divisions. They were either complete amateur programs for the hobbyist or high-end professional video editors for professional productions. At one end there were products like Vegas Video, originally made by Sonic Foundry and later bought by Sony, and at the other end products such as Avid, aimed at the Hollywood market. As the field evolved, many of the video editing program makers introduced more sophisticated consumer video editing software products. These software programs were dubbed prosumer because they were placed between the consumer level and the completely pro level. At the time, Sony Vegas Pro and U Lead Media Studio were a couple of these. At present, the marketplace has evolved yet again with an even better assortment of video editing software available to fit all requirements. An innovative type of very easy to use, simple movie making software has been introduced and for a lot of people these new programs might possibly be exactly what they're in search of. Examples of such new programs are Magic's Video Easy and Corel Digital Studio. Both of these products present relatively minimal video editing capabilities combined with image and sound manipulation. They are often wizard based programs meaning that you follow on screen step by step instructions with regard to how you want your production to look from start to finish. These software programs are ideal for the person who is not technologically minded or simply not that interested in the editing process. Despite their simplicity, they are capable of producing very good results. At the next level are the more well known home user video editing software products such as Cyberlink Power Director, Magic's Movie Edit Pro or Adobe Premiere Elements. These products have developed dramatically over the past few years and today would outgun anything that was labelled prosumer from a few years ago. Here you'll find a superior degree of control given to the user and every step of the video making process can be controlled quite precisely to suit what you want to do. They offer countless special effects and video filtering as well as good audio control, titling and a wide range of output formats. Above this are the prosumer products such as Magic's Video X Pro and Avid Studio. At this point you begin to notice the kinds of features and power that the professionals use. They offer a superior quantity of tracks on the timeline to work with, regardless of if they are for video, sound, commentary, subtitles, titles or whatever. You'll also notice features such as moving paths, meaning items can not just be superimposed but can be caused to move with the action also. They naturally have all the functionality of the video editing software under them, except all of this carries a price. The reality is there are two prices to factor in. The first is basically what you pay. At this level you've moved up to the $500 mark and beyond. The second price appears in the form of a greater learning curve on your way to mastering the complete functionality of the product. Nevertheless, the benefit of these products in the long run is that unless you want to become a professional video editor, there's no need to worry about upgrading and the cost of doing that. As a final point, we've come to the professional tier of video editing software. Truthfully speaking, if you're watching this, then there's no need for you or I to use up too much time here. They are frighteningly daunting in their difficulty and at the same time astonishing in what they can do. Definitely not for the faint of heart and not for the novice by a long way. In deciding on video editing software, be sure to keep in mind your real needs and goals for the program. Don't get distracted by the cool features you may possibly never use. Read the reviews and bear in mind which market each program is intended for and at all times avail yourself of the free trials. For more information on video editing software, go to www.myeasydata.com.